because of the people that stood by, this superstitious, credulous people, because of these people, I am saying this, I am putting up an act that these fools might not think that I am God, I am giving life to the dead, therefore I am making this performance. I said it, that they may believe that thou hast sent me. That's the reason why I am talking like this. Then he says, Lazarus, Lazarus, come out. And Lazarus came out after three days, perhaps stinking from his grave. He says, Hallelujah. Alhamdulillah. Hallelujah. This is praise be to Allah. That's what it means. Ya Allah, who? We say the Christians are Hallelujah. Same. We say, praise be to God. Where does Jesus say he gave life to Lazarus? He's telling you, and he says, look, I don't want these people to misunderstand, but now we have misunderstood a thousand million Christians in the world. They all have misunderstood. They said Jesus gave life to the dead. He doesn't say that. It's God working through him. And Peter, the greatest of the disciples, Jesus had appointed him. He says, Peter, he's given the keys of the heavens. Peter, feed my flock, feed my sheep, mean my followers. This Peter, in the book of Acts, he says, he says, ye men of Israel, O Jews, he's talking to the Jews, hear these words, Jesus of Nazareth, a man approved of God among you by miracles and wonders and signs which God did by him. Who did it? Look, unless Peter is lying and the Holy Spirit that is inspiring him is lying, which God did by him in the midst of you, which you yourself also know. Who did it? God. The power is there. You put on the switch, the power comes on. You didn't supply that electricity, it's coming from the powerhouse. Similarly, Jesus is talking, he's uttering, he's praying, he's asking, and he's getting whose? God's. Jesus, if he is God. He is described as a sleepy God. God doesn't sleep, the Quran says, neither slumber nor sleep overtaketh him. But this God with inverted commas, if he was God, I'm reading Matthew chapter 8 verse 24, he was asleep, God sleeping, he was asleep, Luke chapter 8 verse 23, he fell asleep, God falling asleep, Mark chapter 4 verse 38, and he was in the hinder part of the ship, asleep on a pillow, God, please, please, please. I read this, a heading is a thirsty God, in inverted commas, God in inverted commas. If Jesus is God in inverted commas. He saith, he Jesus, he saith, I thirst. You know, I'm thirsty, but God I am. Thirsty, Jesus is, so God is thirsty. He said, I'm thirsty, I'm drinking, I'm thirsty. Is this the quality of God? I thirst. A weary God. Inverted commas. God. Jesus therefore being wearied, got tired, fatigued. With this journey, sat thus on the well. John chapter 4 verse 6. A sorrowing God. In inverted commas, God. And he began to be sorrowful and very heavy. Matthew chapter 26 verse 37. Then said he unto them, my soul is exceeding sorrowful even unto death. Matthew chapter 26 verse 38. A groaning God. We had dealt with it already. And now with regards to the prophecies. You see one of the points that has been put forth. Was the prophecies. My watch. One of the points was the prophecies. I says, now when you look at the prophecies, hopefully everybody is waiting for Jesus. Anytime, anytime now. The Jehovah's Witnesses, the masterful technique they have. You know, they don't build churches, they don't build schools, no hospitals, no orphanages, nothing. They just do their job. Because you know why? They don't buy farms in South Africa. No farms, no buildings, nothing. They hire halls. They call them kingdom halls. Masterful technique. Any minute Jesus is coming. Any minute and you work people up into a frenzy. But this frenzy is going on for 2,000 years. 
based on, I'm reading Mark chapter 13, verses 26 and 27. It says, Then they will see the Son of Man coming in the clouds with great power and glory. Then they will see the Son of Man, means Jesus Christ, coming in the clouds with great power and glory. And then he will send his angels and gather together his elect from the four winds, from the farthest part of the earth to the farthest part of heaven. Assuredly, 